morning so this is another video on my youtube channel so today i'm just gonna do like make a routine yes like i was live on tiktok and someone asked me like when someone asked me to do like uh youtube videos i asked what you want to see and then um yeah, someone commented nighttime routine, but someone also commented like makeup routine. So I'm just gonna do my makeup routine. So I have this like big ass bucket like of all my makeup, and I don't even use all of it. I just yeah. So the first thing I do is I use this Smooth Miracle Primer, uh, Max Factor, and I. It's old as fuck and it's like crusty and disgusting, but you know, I don't, I don't care. I still use it. And I just like rub it in between my fingers and like put it on my face, like moisturizer. I don't know, I don't know how I'm supposed to do this. I put way too much on. Oops. Oopsies. So I'm just gonna like blend it out, I guess. Because I have way too much on my face, so. So. After that, I would take my foundation, which is uh, Essence Stay All Day, 16 Hours, Long Lasting Foundation, and the color 08 Soft Vanilla. I have got like ice color. Yeah. Um, because it's so good, y'all. Um, and how I do this is like every other person, I think, I guess. Um, just place it on the back of my hand, a few pumps, and like put it on my face like this. Like, this is not like my exact color, but this is like, this is the palest of the foundations that are essence like um that i could buy so i'm using it even though it's a little, a little too yellow for my skin like the funny thing is like i was in the store you know working and then my aunt she comes in and she wants to buy me some makeup and i'm like oh shit i'm like looking at this and i'm like oh shit i kind of want like a foundation and she's like, no, that's like way too light for you, like this color. Um, and now that I've bought it, I'm like, no, it's not. No, it's not. It's a little too dark in it. But I'm gonna use all of this because I'm, I'm not one to buy and not use. That is such bullshit because in the beginning of this video, I was like, I have a lot of makeup that I don't use. Bitch, stop lying. Um, now that you've diddly done that, I do my eyebrows. Yeah, I use the uh, MAC eyeshadow from like years ago. I don't even know what this is. But it's pretty old because I've had this for years and I haven't really used it until now. So I use this for my eyebrows and I guess I just, I don't know. Draw them on, fill them in. So I've got um, really pale eyebrows. Hi. But I think I've finally like figured out how to make nice eyebrows or like how to draw nice eyebrows on. Yeah. Yeah. Because now it's not like a harsh line here. And then just like nothing above it. Like that's how I used to do it. Because I thought that was how you made the like ombre effect. But it did not work. Not, not once. I'm like it was ugly as fuck. Because now that I look at a picture, I'm like, why did, why did it, like, why did my parents let me do that? Why did my dad let me do that? He probably didn't, but I'm like, shut up, you old man. You don't know nothing about makeup. 
I just did it anyways. God damn. Ugh. So now I take a brush and my foundation once again and do a little tiny little dollop. And then I take the brush and I like I don't know if you can see, I don't know how to explain what I'm doing, but I'm like kind of like going like this, like this, like on both sides. So it looks kind of like that. You can't even see it, bro. I'm just sitting here like, do you see it? <laughs> do you see it? I carved my eyebrows out with this. I just like, yeah. Then I try to kind of like blend it a little out with the brush. Um, like this, but it kind of—it's kind of hard because the brush is wet. So then I do the same thing, just like on top, like that, and then I take my beauty blender to kind of blend it out a little bit more. Um, just make sure it's—I don't know—not crusty and gross. Then I do the other eyebrow, just the exact same. Yeah. Blend it out, blend it out. Blend it all out. So now, I take the uh, Super Stay Active Wear Maybelline New York uh, concealer in the color 10. And I just like put it under my eyes, on my cheeks, like down to here, my, like on the sides of my nose, here, along my nose, down my nose like that, in the middle of my forehead. And on my chin and on my eyelids and then just do, 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 blend it all out that's good shit that's some good shit uh, I'm not funny no, I'm a little guy now that all that is blended out beautifully, um, I take I take this eyeshadow palette. This is a H and M eyeshadow palette, and I only use like one shade out of here. I use that one down here to contour my face because I don't have any like I have this highlight and contour palette but it's all creams and I don't really like creams I'm gonna use that shade and then just start with my cheekbones um slowly like that and then just start um, blending it upwards, I guess. I don't really know what I'm doing. I don't want to explain what I'm doing. And if it's too dark, I just take my beauty blender and just blend it a little out. Blend it out a little. Then I kind of take it upwards. My hair is getting stuck. I take the contour up my face like this. Kind of like. Take it on the sides of my head here and on the top of my head. Just because I have a huge forehead and I want to make it look like it's smaller. Smaller! I actually like just woke up. I woke up, um, ate some breakfast, bro <laughs> broke a plate, picked it up, cleaned it up, um, vacuumed it up and then made some iced coffee and do my makeup 
Because I wanted to do this like the f as the first thing I did when I woke up because then I wouldn't have to do it like later in the day. Um, and also I just get my makeup over with, you know, just get it done. Get it done! So I can do like other shit um, throughout the day. Like I need to wash clothes. Um, you know, I'm going to my mom's tomorrow. So I gotta have clean clothes. Or if I just, if I don't have time for that, I can just take dirty clothes and just wash them at my mom's place. And I also need to find my now ex-boyfriend's clothes because I have to give it back to him probably tomorrow or sometime when I'm at my mom's place. So yeah, that's gonna be pretty tough. I'm not looking forward to it. Because, like, I obviously miss him. <laughs> like, duh. And it's gonna be kind of... I'm not kind of sad to see him again. Anyways, enough with the sad shit. Now I take um, this kind of brush. And I dip it in the same color that I used for my cheekbones and forehead. And uh, kind of, like, blow on it. Like, I dip it in. <laughs> blow. And then I like lightly take it on my nose tip, just lightly. Don't like, you know, rape your nose. Just do it lightly. And then you do the same thing down the sides of your nose, lightly. Up into your eyebrow. And then just, you know. Wipe off the contour palette, palette with color thing. Just wipe off the powder and then kind of attempt to blend it out. And after that, you take your beauty blender and like blend it out with, yeah, with it. We do the same thing on the other side. And then when you've done like both of those sides, you take the same color again on this brush and then just do like a line there. So you can have like a cute little button nose. Then I blend it out a little and I just like go back and forth between the beauty blender and the brush to make it look seamless kind of. And now, now that I've contoured, I take um, the rice powder, setting powder by Wet n Wild, I think. I don't know, it's like all rubbed off, rubbed off. But I use this um, to bake and to set the makeup. Um, but I set it all first because it's kind of hard to set your makeup when you when you're baking. I don't know. I just like to do do it first, like all the areas that aren't um, that aren't getting baked. I'm just setting them before I bake. My forehead, between my eyebrows, my eyelids, my chin, here. There we go. Now I take my beauty blender and I dip it in, like so. Dip it in. So it looks like this. And then I start with my nose under eye area. And I just kind of draw. Do it like that. Drag it down. And then I tap, 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 tap. Drag. I go back here just to perfect it. Ah, shit, I got it in my eye. And then I use a little tip on here um, to kind of like bake the center of my nose, like the bridge, the bridge and the tip. Like that, kind of. And then I put my beauty blender back into here, like, and then I drag it down here 
I do the same thing on the other side. Just come out like that. Like so. Um. Meow. What the fuck was that? That sounded like some cartoon character voice. What was that? But now, while I'm like waiting for this, I'm gonna do the eyeballs. I'm gonna do the eyeballs. And I'm just gonna start with the eyeliner. So the first thing I do, now that I've started with my eyes, now that I'm baking, I can't take black, I can't uh, take black eyeshadow under here because I'm baking it and it kind of messes everything up. So I just start with my eyeliner and I just, I don't explain how I do it. I do like a line from my eye outwards, like so. And then while I'm looking, because my eyes are hooded, so this is kind of like a trick that I'm doing to make it look good. Now that I'm looking forward, I draw a line, just like right across onto my eyelid. Kind of like so, so it looks like that. So I just, you know, drew it right across. And then I, while I'm looking, I fill it in. That's how I do the eyeliner. That's how I do eyeliner for hooded eyes. And if it's still like not fully connected, you can go back and like do some touch up. I don't know how to explain it. I just kind of do it. <laughs> I just kind of do it, you know? It's fine. It's fine. Kind of messing it all up. So if I mess up, I just take the same brush used for my eyebrows and like carve it away. Now I think the, the baking has been on for plenty of time. So I'm wiping it off with a bigger brush. Wiping it off. Now I take a uh, eyeshadow palette. I don't even know what this is. It's Gosh uh, Nine Shades Shadow Collection. Yeah, this is what it says. I don't know if you can see it. Never mind. So I take this and I open it and I take these two red shades. And I kind of like softly apply it. Do the same on the other side. And then a little on my nose. And after that, I take this palette, which is the Essence Choose Your Glow Highlighter Palette, which is actually so good. Um, but I take the middle one, so I just lightly take it because it's really pigmented i lightly take it on my cheekbone you see that i don't know if you can see that but it's like already glowing lightly take it and now i take a tiny teeny tiny teeny tiny brush that's that small and i Dip it in the color, and then I put it on the tip of my nose. Dab it out with my finger and take it down the bridge of my nose. Blend it out with my finger. And in my inner corners, right here, under my eyebrow. And then just on there. See that? So what I do next is I take, did I even show you what um, eyeliner I use? No. It's this one. It's the Wonder Ink Eyeliner 
by by what? <laughs> I don't know. Oh yes, Rimmel, Rimmel. And um, then I use this for the waterline, which is the essence. Kai Kajal, Kajal, K A J A L, pencil eyeliner. Yeah. And I use it for my waterline. So I pull my eye down a little bit and then just draw it. It in. And then on the other side, and then I also do like the top waterline, pull it and draw across. And I do the same thing on the other eye. And now, now I take this uh, eyeshadow brush and I dip it in the black one, the same I use for my eyebrows, and I just kind of take it from my eyeliner, like, I don't know if you see what I'm doing, like, here, and then just drag it down to, like, half of my, um, waterline. Connect it down. And then I take some mascara and I put it on. It's the <coughs> Max Max Factor <coughs> Max Factor Masterpiece Max High Volume and Definition Mascara. And then I do the Bottom lashes. What is going on with my voice? It's like the whole all the time. But I make those stupidest faces. There, no. Everyone does. So I don't feel weird. It would be weird if someone sat like doing their mascara just like. That's weird. That's fucking weird. Like, that feels like natural. Then I do like a second coat on my top lashes. And now the finishing touch is just setting spray. And it's the essence instant. Uh, instant matte makeup setting spray yeah and it's free from oil and alcohol um and then i just like put it all over my face <laughs> like that and then i just like do this i'm gonna use the book and then i just Wait for it to dry. So now my makeup is a done. Kind of want to like show a closer look of it. So that's what I'm gonna do. As you can see, it's like it's a little darker than me, but not that much. Like if I hold my phone out here, it's not that noticeable, is it? I don't know. But this is the makeup look. Um, it's pretty, pretty good, I guess. So yeah, I'm gonna end the video now. Thanks for watching. Hope you liked it. Yes. Yeah. Um, and I will see you in the next one. If there is going to be one. I'm like kind of. I don't know if there's gonna be a next one. I don't know if that is what is what that is gonna be, but maybe there'll be a next one. Like, yeah. Okay. Bye.